There are over a hundred utilities across North America that are involved and we are getting together with a database documenting all of these different types of scams that are occurring. My name is Terry Lewis. I'm a customer care supervisor here at Northwestern Energy. One of the first things that um, the scammer will do is demand money right now. Last fall, when I got off work, I had a number that called my cell phone and I thought, oh, I wonder if it's a scammer. <laughs> so it was. My name's Jessica McGee. I have been with Northwestern Energy almost three and a half years. A lot of scammers, when they do call, the hardest part um, is they're trying to get you when you're at your worst. They will ask you to transfer money onto a third party um, payment service, or they'll ask you to run to um, the grocery store or to the pharmacy and pick up a prepaid card, and they want it done now, or we're gonna be there in 30 minutes, which is something that Northwestern Energy does not do. I uh, get a gentleman on the phone, and he's like, okay, so you haven't paid your bill. And I said, well, what address is this for? And they came up with my home address. And I'm like, ooh, this is kind of starting to scare me. <laughs> you know, it was really alarming on what they knew. And I'm like, well, what do I owe? And he rambled off $98.41. And I'm like, mm, for what month? Well, July. You haven't paid your bill since July. Really? And you haven't shut me off yet? No. Nope. The guy pretty much couldn't handle the questions and like started crying and hung up on me. Proactive steps that customers can take. Go to My Energy account. That is a great resource on our website. So working for Northwestern Energy, I knew I could get on our website. So northwesternenergy.com. There's a search bar there, so I typed in scam form, and it comes with a nice form that you could put all that information in to get it submitted. You sign in, you can look at your balance, you can look at your last bill amount. There's a lot of different features on there. You can look at your bill, know how much you owe, look at your bank records, find out if you've paid Northwestern Energy. The best thing to always do though, if you can get a callback number and your caller ID, it's so helpful for us so that we can deter those numbers. With Northwestern Energy, we never demand money. You know, we don't. We try to work with you if there's anything owing or anything like that. I really feel that we let the customers know if they're going to be disconnected. They should know that that's going on. It's not a quick thing that happens.